Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to replace the flex cable on a Sigma 18-200mm DC OS lens after the lens has been disassembled. Recently I had this lens which had aperture problems. The aperture did not work and it was caused by a faulty flex cable. So I had to disassemble the lens, replace the flex cable with a new one and then assemble the lens. In this video I show you how to replace the flex cable with a new one after the lens has been disassembled. This video is part of a video series about repairing the Sigma 18-200mm lens. In the first video I showed you how to disassemble the lens. This second one is about replacing the flex cable with a new one. And the third video is about assembling the lens. If you're interested, the links are here or down in the description below. Before I would start, let me talk about the tools that I will use to replace the flex cable with a new one. I will use a PH30 screwdriver, a metal tweezers, an adjustable metal tweezers, a soldering gun, a soldering iron and a desoldering pump, and of course I will need a new flex cable. If you are interested in buying them, then the links are in the description below. If you find this video useful, informative and adds value to you, then like and share this video, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. The links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. In the previous video I disassembled the lens and removed the aperture unit. Now I have to remove the remains of the flex cable. I use a soldering gun and a desoldering pump to remove the soldering iron. Remove the remains of the flex cable from the aperture motor. In the next step, install the new flex cable. I use a thin half millimeter soldering iron.
Stick the flux cable to the aperture unit and place it under the wire. Solder the two connectors to the aperture unit. We are done with replacing the flat cable on the aperture unit. In the next video I continue with assembling the lens. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find it useful, informative and adds value to you, then like and share this video, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. The links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. See you next time in my other video.